Good morning all, it's the Devious Monkey here on yet another Bagel Sunday. It is crappy out. It's 44 degrees, overcast, raining, and slightly windy. So yeah, not gonna be one of those days where I'm out driving all over the place playing, but that's okay, because I don't need to do that. What I'm gonna do today, and I'm sure that you're all gonna be thrilled for this, is I'm gonna clean a closet. The closet in the library is a mess. It has become a complete dumping ground as usual. Basically, this is a holdover from my days as an eBay seller. I save everything, every box, every manual for anything that I buy. I gotta have some place to put it. Where do I put it? I put it in that closet. I have kept so many boxes over the years and, and then every once in a while I have to purge. Well, the last big purge I did, I took, I think, like three of those contractor-sized garbage bags and filled them with boxes. And I literally went through every single box in the closet, opened it up, looked to see if there was anything in it, like headphones or cables, or anything that, that might have been left behind. A lot of them had like little pouches and bags and shit. So I went through and I decided, all right, what am I gonna keep? What am I not gonna keep? What gets thrown away? What gets donated? And it took me an entire like day of going through all that shit and then having to lug all that shit down and throw it away. Won't be so bad this time as far as the boxes, although I have collected a lot of boxes. Now I don't keep it to sell it. I keep it so that I have it long enough for me to be able to return it if something happens to it. Generally, that's only like 30 days. So there's no reason for me to keep all that shit. But again, it goes in the closet and I forget about it. Well, my wife wants more room to hang dresses and shit. And you know, there's no point in, in that closet being taken up with all that crap. So that's what I thought to myself yesterday that I'm gonna do today. So I'll be cleaning out that closet and I have a ton of clothing in there. Now, this is all from, I mean, a lot of it's from even before moving here because I don't, like, I don't buy clothes. So I wear the same shit over and over again. As you can tell when you watch any of my videos, you see that I wear nothing but black. Everything's black now. I have several of the same colored, uh, like the same pants, several of the same t-shirts, and then in the summer, several of the same shorts. And that's it. And then I wear my black hoodie, I wear a black hat. You get it? I wear black. So all the shit that's in my closet, that's all bright and colorful, or doesn't fit anymore, or it's just ratty because I've had it for 20 years, I need to get rid of all that shit. So that's what's gonna happen. I am going to get rid of all that shit. For now, I need to get bagels, because I'm hungry. It's late. I slept in, felt great. Okay, kids, I've got the closet in the, the library completely cleaned up the way that I wanted it to be anyway, sort of the way she needs it to be because she's hanging dresses, so she needs it to go all the way down. And I just had too much crap there. So I went through, again, threw away all the crap boxes that I don't need for shit that I, a lot of it I found, I didn't even have it anymore. So I got rid of all that. And then I decided I had a ton of bags they were just smushed into two boxes and then stacked on top of those boxes. I just collect bags. And like if I order a lens or something like that and they send a free bag with a bunch of shit in it, I, th those get thrown into that corner. So all that is now packed up back into the two boxes. I have a bunch of bags that I'm keeping and I'm gonna go buy like a big Rubbermaid storage thing for those because I have one space that I cleared on the, on the rack. And then I have a ton of like clothing and shit that I'm gonna drop off at the Goodwill. So I'm gonna load up the truck, go to Goodwill, then I'm gonna go to Target, and I gotta get that tote, I gotta get cat litter, and I have to get, I think, some kind of like the baking powder, soda, whatever the hell it is, Arm & Hammer shit, because those freaking rugs, or at least the big one, I think, is the one that stinks, because it's been rolled up and stuffed out there forever, and when it unrolled it and unleashed this scent that I will not deal with. So I need to dump a bunch of that on there to try to absorb that odor and, you know, see what happens from there. So let's load up the truck. So, all right, let's go tote shopping. Bean has been gotten. All right, no point blathering. 
Let's go home and finish this crap. All right, this is gonna be tricky. I got a lot of bags left that I have to try to jam in here. I did it. All right, it's about ready to burst at the seams, but that's okay. I got them all in there. Okay, kids, this is it. I'm done, totally done here. I got all the bags that I decided to keep smushed into that damn Rubbermaid thing. Albeit they're still trying to pop out, but it's wedged into the, uh, the rack now and there it stays. I did come across another issue when I was down there. When I opened up the garage door to bring everything in that I bought, the wind caught the blankets on the background stand and blew it over. So that cascaded over, knocked down my tripod, didn't quite get the light. So I have now put those back up and I have them bungee corded to the, well, on the one side to the shelves and to the other side to the rack. So now if the wind catches it, it isn't gonna knock it over because I don't need that shit. So that's taken care of. Now I'm gonna show you the closet that I cleaned out for her to use. This is the side of the closet that I'm keeping. It is jam packed. So now you can see it. I have like some old suits in there, just some clothes that I'm not gonna get rid of. Everything is jammed in there. Again, couldn't quite get a grape in there. So that's all there, but then that is completely open so that she has all the space to put in her dresses or whatever the hell she wants to put in there. So that's it kids, done. I have successfully commandeered my garage back from the clutter that was in there and now have it set up as a combination second studio, gym, and garage. And it's done, I don't need to do anything else. Everything is put away. I have pretty much decided based on feedback from Yankee Cowboy and my mother-in-law that they could not hear any echo or reverb and that the audio sounded good. So I will not be hanging any of that audio tile in the garage. Plus, like my mother-in-law had mentioned, that it might add weight to the door and mess up the garage door opener itself. I don't know how heavy that shit is, but I'm not gonna take a chance. And since no one can hear it, not gonna bother with it. One less thing to do. I have now cleaned out this closet in the library and gotten rid of all the shit that I don't need and made room for my wife to put her dresses or whatever the hell she wants in there. And I am now getting down to just a few bags that I actually wanna keep. That's it, that's all I got. I need to get on and snarf some pasta now. If you have any comments, questions, or suggestions, leave them down below. As always, thank you for joining me. Be sure to like and subscribe. And remember kids, forward and up.